We're here at the Royal Mint to give you an insight into how they make coins, medals and more. Now, the process of actually minting a coin is utterly fascinating and the Royal Mint is one of the best in the world at doing it. So let's find out what's involved. So Wayne, where are we? Uh, we're in the Royal Mint in Clantrescent and we're currently in the circulating coin department. Right, and what goes on here? This is where we strike all of the circulation coins, like 10 P's and 20 P's, and also where we pack them and send them out to the customer as well. So when you say strike, that's sort of making the coin? Uh, yeah, where we turn a blank into a coin, which is basically putting a head and a tail on it. Um, this is where all of the circulation coins have been made over the, the last number of years. This is a high speed 750 mi a minute. I'm Coin sorry, 750 a minute? Yeah, maximum 750 a minute. Wow. That's 45,000 an hour. <laughs> oh my gosh, these things are fast. And, and talk me through sort of how, how did they do that many? Um, well, basically it goes very fast. Yeah. <laughs> Oh. It's obviously an engineering machine that goes really fast. Um, the blanks are loaded into hoppers, as you can see. They're done by forklift. It goes all the way through the machine, and there's what's called a dial plate, which rotates the blanks around to the striking area. And that goes up and down seven, up to 750 a minute, and the, the struck coins are taken around and exit out of these chutes. So basically, they're brought in, put on this ring, and there's just this constant sort of um, die being... Yes. Push down, push down. And Two dies going up and down. Is really makes fast, sense. Yeah. Otherwise, you don't want a head without a tail, do you? No. <laughs> and so, how many coins come out of this factory floor in a day? Uh, well, it's about we do about 120 million a week. So whatever that creates doing a in a day. 120 million coins a week. And how many machines do you have? 27 coin presses. And they're working all the way through the day? Yeah, mostly, yeah. When we make uh, bimetal coins, which is like a pound coin or a two pound, obviously it, it's two different colour materials. And basically it's a ring and an inner. Now, how we get them together to produce a single coin, I'll go over briefly with this uh, yeah, jig. Yeah. Right, coming in, we've got rings, which are like washers. Uh -huh. These are driven in on a belt system. Uh, after, be, after the delivery of the hopper, um, they go underneath what's called a bridge. Then there's a tube system that brings the inners down and gravity fed into the ring. Then the belt system pushes the ring and the inner, which are then assembled further forward, which are these are then taken around into the striking area. That is so simple, but so clever. What is this? This is our push-out machine. Push-out push out machine. Right. What it does... I, I assume it pushes stuff out, but what? <laughs> what it's supposed to do is push the inner out of the outer. So this is after you've made the coin, after this is a way to test it. Well, as you can see, there's the inner. That's the outer. Right. You notch the groove. Yeah. When the press strikes it, you've got... Ooh, 80 ton of pressure usually, and it expands the inner. Yeah. That groove expands and locks it into the outer. So I can put this in? Yeah. Does it matter which way up? Any way you want. Okay, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go tails. The tails always fail. <laughs> Shut the door, should. I assume. Cool. Close the door, push the handle in. Ah, yeah. Red twist. Right. Reset the middle. To touch the that scale, one? yeah. So it goes to zero. Just touch it harder? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Touch the button there. This one? Yeah. Hey, right, come on! Come down now. Very slow. And how much pressure, how much force are we talking about? Minimum of 1.2 kilonewtons. 1.2 kilonewtons, so that's like 1.2 ton. Right, you could hear the knock. I did. That's about the pressure that's going through. Push in it. 
And you can see and then. This is it. The groove. Yeah. There's the inner. You've just killed a pound coin. I can load. <laughs> <laughs> we wouldn't get that back in though. Oh, I like a challenge. I will not get that back in. <laughs> it won't go! <laughs> I just can't get over that every UK coin that I have in my possession came from here. It's, it's millions and millions and millions of them over the years, yes. I, no, not, not that I, I, I No. <laughs> Yeah, it's quite, a, it's quite simple, a coin in your pocket, but it's quite a difficult process to actually get in there. Absolutely, and it's one that you don't often think about, but as soon as you no. do, you are like, all these different arms of engineering are open yeah. up. Lots of, lots of engineering, surprisingly. That's brilliant, thank you. Who knew that making coins involved such a genius process? A process that the Vile Mint have made so efficient that they can make 12 coins in one second. And it's a process that's constantly changing, even though the Vile Mint have been around for more than a thousand years. Now to find out more about the Vile Mint, check out all of our videos at the Vile Mint Museum.org.uk.